Good morning everyone. Welcome to our morning inspiration. Monday, May 13, 2024. May God be with you today and may the spirit of his love fill your hearts with joy. And may you experience the goodness of God's grace today. Amen. Our reading today comes to us from Revelation chapter 1, reading from verse 4 to 6. And it says, John to the seven churches which are in Asia, Grace be unto you, and peace from him which is, and which was, and which is to come, and from the seven spirits which are before his throne, and from Jesus Christ, who is the faithful witness, and the first begotten of the dead, and the prince of the kings of the earth, unto him that love us and wash us from our sin in his own blood, and had made us kings and priests unto God and his Father. To him be glory and dominion forever and ever. Amen. So a couple of things we can see here. As the angel addressed John, he identified who gave him this message to give to John to the churches from him which is which speaks to what the present and which was which speak to the past or the beginning and which is to come which speak to the future so the God of everything yesterday today and tomorrow it goes on to to say that who is the witness or who is the faithful witness no in last week's lesson we studied about the two weakness and so here revelation is telling us again that christ is the witness because what both old testament and new testament speak of who christ jesus and john tells us in chapter one that the word was and is what god and became what flesh to dwell among us so this is the same witness are we getting it and he is the first begotten of the dead yeah remember his resurrection all right it says that he is the prince of the kings of the earth so god is the rightful ruler and heir to this earth unto him that love us don't christ love us that's precisely why he's giving us this information so that he can save us yes he washes us from our sins in his blood his sacrifice on the cross and he has what made us kings and priests what did paul say that we are what a royal priesthood and a what a chosen generation and he did what he called us out of darkness into his marvelous light amen so his resume is very extensive and that, that is what qualifies him to give us this information because he knows everything because he was there from the very beginning and so he knows the beginning he knows the present and he knows the future so who better to inform us about the future him that has always been there and so it would be wise of us if we heed the information that is given to us and so let us take god's word and let us heed his instruction because what he say to us is what will and shall be so may god bless you today and may you enjoy the rest of your day as you continue to look to him who is able to guide you amen